This is one of Nigeria's most important roads, the Shagamu Ijebode Ore Benin Expressway, a 492 kilometer lifeline that connects Lagos, Ogun, Ondo, Edo, and Delta states and links the southwest to the south south, the southeast, and even the northern regions through Benin Aochi access. For decades, this road has been the heartbeat of trade, movement, and survival for millions of Nigerians. But it also became a symbol of neglect, a road where progress slowed and lives were lost. Originally constructed in the late 1970s, the Shagamu Bini Expressway was a project of national pride, built to unite regions, move goods, and strengthen Nigeria's economy. Every day, an estimated 50,000 vehicles ply these roads, nearly 18 million annually, from Lagos ports to factories in Ogun, to farms in Ondo and traders heading east or north. Everything flows through this corridor. But years of poor maintenance turn this vital artery into a nightmare. Riddled with potholes, bottlenecks and accidents. For transporters, it meant delays. For traders, higher costs. For families, heartbreak. But change is finally on the way. The federal government, through the Ministry of Works, has awarded the reconstruction of this critical corridor to CBC Global Civil and Building Construction Nigeria Limited. This section from the Shagamo Interchange to Shagamo Junction is a part of Section 1. This is the Shagamu, Ijebode, and um, Benin Expressway. So like this is the pavement that has been done over time. And um, this project is really amazing and it's going to reduce gridlock on this road. Uh, this road has been known for several traffic and people have actually wasted a lot of time here, especially during festive periods when people go to different parts of uh, Nigeria, especially those that are going to the east and um, some uh, western states. Unlike the previous asphalt surface, the new construction uses rigid concrete pavement, stronger, more durable, and designed to withstand heavy-duty trucks. It's a bold shift towards sustainability, a design that promises decades of endurance and reduced maintenance costs. Contractors are working simultaneously across multiple states, and the difference is already visible. Smooth lanes, proper drainage, and safer intersections are returning hope to road users who have long suffered on this route. I'm actually driving on the road and it's actually very nice, very smooth. I love the fact that it's a um, concrete slab, not the normal like asphalt. And um, this is the Shagamu, um, Ijebode and uh, Bini Expressway. The popular road, everyone going to the east passes. If you are going to Ondo, you pass here. You're going to Bini, you're going to Worry. You are going to Anambra. This is where you're going to pass. And it's actually very like, look at the pavement. Show it, show it. Look at, look at, look at. It's concrete, solid concrete, solid concrete. Not the normal asphalt, you know. So this is actually going to um, stand the test of time. It's going to last very long. This project is actually long overdue. And um, this is amazing. The expressway is more than just the road. It's a lifeline of commerce. Once completed, travel time between Lagos and Benin will drop drastically, 
truck drivers will spend less time in traffic, reducing logistic costs. Perishable goods can now move faster to markets. Small businesses will thrive again. Improved mobility means lower transportation costs, safer journey, and better access to healthcare and education for communities along this corridor. In a country where road transport moves over 90% of goods, fixing this single expressway could unlock billions in economic potential and ease the cost of doing business nationwide. Still, the journey isn't over. Delays, funding challenges, and weather conditions often slow projects like this. Nigerians have seen many good beginnings that never reached the end. But this time, there's renewed optimism. The work pace is visible. And with proper oversight and commitment, the project can redefine road infrastructure standards in Nigeria. The Shagamo Ijabo de Ore Bini Expressway is more than just concrete and steel. It's a story of hope, resilience, and the promise of a better Nigeria. For decades, we waited for this lifeline to be revived. And now, piece by piece, it's happening. The question is, will this time be different? Only time will tell, but for now, we can see progress and we can dare to hope. I hope this video brought value to you and maybe even a smile. If you enjoyed it, Please like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss what's coming next.